When you were out there doing that tour duty, all those tough workouts, did you ever stop to think, man, I could be signing a million dollar contract? Uh, definitely, you definitely get those thoughts, but at the same time, you think about uh, like more, more things like that's bigger than just money, you know, just the bond you, you're building with these guys over, over these last couple of years. Think about what you're going to be able to do in the fall, uh, all the great things that you accomplish. You know, it's, it's, you don't play football just for the money. You got to love the game. What's, what's the big difference in the workouts this preseason and compared to last? Oh, that's super intense, you know, um, high motor. Um, Really strained, uh, being successful, you know, doing everything right, the right way, not just ch coming in, checking the box, and just getting your work in. And gonna, you want to do everything to perfectly, you know, just coming in, just developing that uh, that drive, that passion to uh, be great. Between the, uh, the the different jerseys at, at tour of duty, how do you feel like accountability has has changed, or do you feel like it has, has changed? Accountability and discipline has been a huge part of this program and, and the shift that we're going through right now. Um, Coach Novell has held, held us to a very high standard, not just us leaders, but every, even onto the walk-ons. Everybody has their part. Everybody has to play the role. And what we don't do right, you got to hold us accountable. You can't just let anything slip, you know. And it's just it's amazing uh, how like the holding us accountable and the discipline has actually changed our team for the better. Those feel like guys are actually caring about the program a lot more. Football is more big, bigger aspect in our, our lives right now. Uh, people come ready to work every single day. You don't see anybody really coming in with bad attitudes. Tools, guys approach the game the right way, you know, and, it's, and I love love seeing it. Uh, helps me get up in the morning. You know, I remember uh, this week one of my teammates, um, uh, Jalen Goss, I uh, missed my alarm. He came in, it was like, Marv, it's time to get up. And I hopped up out of bed, ready to go. I like, let's go get it, you know, uh, we ready to go attack it. And that's five o'clock in the morning, you know, he just turned up. You, you come in, five o'clock, you see Coach Norville turned up, ready to go, just like us. On your decision to come back, was there something you saw in Mike Norvell or something in this coaching staff or some change? It really kind of provided incentive for you to come back. Um, it's something I saw in this program and on my teammates that I knew uh, we we can do better and we deserve better. So um, I owe it all to my guys. Uh, I suit up with every other weekend. And, um, I believe in them as much, as much as they believe in me. We're going to go out and we're going to do great things this year. That's the plan. Mom, you got any personal goals for this spring? Uh, going through this spring, really, I just want to uh, just learn the defense. You know, just come in, uh, work on my pass rush moves. Uh, really uh, recognize play uh, formations. You know, play recognition. Get in there, watch more film on myself, and just identify a lot of weaknesses that I need to fix before the season. Are you learning the defense, you chance to talk to any of the coaches about the scheme for this coming season. Uh, most definitely, um, got to uh, get up there, and talk to Coach Clint, uh, Coach uh, JP, you know, uh, Coach Fuller. Uh, Joe, uh, Joe and a lot of different guys on the staff. Whoever's in the defense staff room when I go up there, that's why I really talk with, getting there, go over some plays, signals, uh, learning different responsibilities, not just mine, but the uh, DBs and linebackers really trying to exp expand my IQs. Uh, you know, slowly but surely, it's like, it's kind of like feeling like, I now feel like what a quarterback feels like when he goes to the playbook, just uh, knowing what everybody has to do at the same time. It really could be nerve-wracking there sometimes, you know, uh, but at the same time, you just it's all about repetition.